Escaping side control in a street fight. Joe has me in side control. What I'm doing right now is I'm just holding Joe by the neck and the inside of the shoulder. Um, sometimes you can hold down by the tricep if you like, but either or, neck, shoulder, or tricep. And the reason why is if, if Joe gets any space and is able to get away from me, I have to worry about him elbowing me or punching me in the face. So unlike uh, traditional kind of escapes, uh, say for example, if I was going for a ghost escape, how I would slide my hand under, reach out and come through, that's too much space. But by the time I do all that in a street fight, Joe might cave my eye in. So in a street fight, believe it or not, we're not up against a clock and we're not up against referees or anything. So it's not on us. The burden's not on us to move. It's just to stay safe. So escaping side control in a street fight would look something like this. I'm here. I'm monitoring his hip with my knee, with my other leg, and I'm just gonna wait here patiently until Joe decides to move. Because in a street fight, he'll give me the space I need to get my frames in and escape.